I started Moms in Heels because I wanted to capture what it feels like being a woman today. I wanted to bring into spotlight um, women who challenge society perceptions about, um, about them. As much as society is there to blame for unrealistic expectations, uh, we have for ourselves, it is also the women who agree and accept to play along these rules. I think women have become their worst enemy. When did we start thinking of becoming the perfect wife, uh, build successful career and be at every theater play our kid is into? Not to forget that perfect body that we want. Uh, we expect to be superhumans and we forget somehow to have fun and enjoy what we have achieved. Isn't it curious how people pick others to be in their lives, at work, at home and at play, not because they're perfect, but to have fun, learn and grow? As much as women are nowadays so creative, so talented and so productive and focused, as much as we keep criticizing and bitching ourselves, why? We need to start celebrating more. On Monks in Hills, we want to look at the woman after she marries or finds her dream job. What happens after that? After she travels the world, changes a couple of partners or more, becomes a mom or stays single, goes through loss and disappointment. Do you walk on heels all the time? No, for God's sake, no, of course not. But uh, if I could, I would. <laughs> what stops you? Blisters. <laughs> Women always try to fit into some kind of a model, but I'm interested in those who find a way to create their own life and happiness in the middle of the socio-cultural noise. At the end, becoming a mom is not everything. It is not the ultimate mission a woman has to achieve. It is not the end of the road for the modern woman. I've always been fascinated by Pedro Almodovar movies, the way he portrays women through their idiosyncrasies and the nervous breakdowns he communicates their genius. Maybe this is what was my very first inspiration. What do you appreciate the most in your everyday life? Purpose and personal style. Uh, when we have a purpose, we live more meaningful lives. Um, as for personal style, I've always been drawn to details and context. Um, the it piece never really interested me. It is how you wear it. For, for me, fashion is about experience. It is about adding value. <laughs> the most successful ingredient of your brand. <sighs> I think we try to be authentic and always in progress, work in progress.